a loud call for peace heard in the streets as marchers make their way from northern Manhattan to the Bronx. The symbolic walk, a show of unity against guns and violent crimes plaguing our city. We want peace, we want love, we want live and happiness. Nobody want to live in a violent community, so we want love and peace and joy. The second annual Walk the Bridge for Peace event, drawing support from elected officials, religious leaders, and community members who say now more than ever, New York needs to show the world why peace must prevail. Overwhelmed, filled with emotion because there's just so much happening. Uh, what's going on in the Middle East and praying for our brothers and sisters, uh, obviously in Israel and what's happening at Gaza with Hamas and what's happening right here in our city every single day with violence, with gun violence, with domestic and gender based violence. While the latest NYPD statistics show that most crimes have declined compared to earlier in the year, marchers feel that some communities can be safer. It's been, it's been crazy for a few months. I mean, with all the uh, mopeds and all that stuff and people shooting, but I'm against uh, any kind of violence. Bridges bring people together, and this is bringing together the northern Manhattan with the Bronx. In honor of Hispanic Heritage Month, two communities with predominantly Latino residents taking a stand against guns and gun violence. We will be kidding ourselves if we think that the police on their own can actually fix this. This is our duty. Our duty is to try to stop the violence from happening in our communities.